In this video, we're doing more cleaning. So if you want to find out more, stick around. Hello, this is Stephanie of Creatively Miss Me, and you're in the right place if you want to make decorating a bit easier on the budget. If so, then click that red subscribe button you see down below. A bell will appear. Click that bell and then click all. This way you'll be notified each time I upload something new. And while we're here, give your girl a thumbs up. It doesn't cost you a thing to give me a thumbs up, but it will help my channel. And also comment and share my video. Today, I'm continuing on with my series of a healthy and natural home series. Now, today's title, we're going to talk about hacks with baking soda. 10 hacks with baking soda. Our number one is a trash can deodorizer. You sprinkle a small amount into your, of baking soda into your trash once a week to help absorb odors. Number two. It's a dishwasher cleaner. You sprinkle it in the bottom of an empty dishwater, dishwasher and let it sit overnight. And then the next day, turn it on and let it rinse away and it shall clean your dishwasher. It will take out the odor, any odors in your dishwasher. Number three, a garbage disposal refresher. Now you pour baking soda slowly in the drain and run in tap water and turn on your garbage disposal, it'll help clean out any odors that are in your garbage disposal. But sometimes you know those things really smell. Number four, it's a cutting board deodorizer. Now you sprinkle a little baking soda on your cutting board after you use it and scrub it to disinfect it. Rinse it, dry it, put it away. Number five, it's a drain cleaner. You pour a half a cup of baking soda followed by a half a cup of vinegar down the drain and let it fizz. Then pour six cups of hot water down the drain and that should knock it out. Number six, it is a vacuum cleaner odor remover. You sprinkle baking soda on your carpet and vacuum up and it removes all the odors in your carpet. Our next one is a laundry brightener. You put a half a cup of baking soda in a load of laundry to boost the color and help fight stains. Now this is a really good thing because I do it with socks and I do it with colored clothes as well. I put a cup of baking soda in, especially with towels. I'll put it in and it'll freshen them up. It'll take off any smelly odors that they may have. And our next one is, it's a chrome polisher. You can put it on the chrome on your faucets or a little damp rag, wipe it off, then wipe it down and they will shine like new money.
it's a comb and brush our next one is it's a comb and brush cleaner you take um you soak your comb and brush overnight in water and a mixture of water and a teaspoon of baking soda now this helps clean them and deodorize them it works well and also a vacuum deodorizer. It will deodorize your vacuum cleaner. So once you vacuum it up from the carpet and you have it in your vacuum cleaner, if something's in your bag and it's making it smell, or if you have one of those canisters on the front, and the, once the baking soda gets off in there, any odor that's coming out from that, the baking soda will help kill that odor and help freshen your vacuum cleaner. Now I hope this was helpful because I did learn some new items. So if you learned anything new from this, let me know down below. If you haven't gone already to check out creativelymissme.com, check out my blog, where I have created forms to make planning easier for home organization and for content creators. Make sure you sign up for the quickest update. And this is Stephanie from Creatively Miss Me saying, thank you for watching and you be blessed.